What's the crack lads? We're back with episode 3 of our My League. Some good games in this, some good highlights, so hope you guys enjoy it. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Let's go. Alright boys, we're straight in versus Sheffield United. Pretty much the same team, Wambasaka, Mainu, Eriksen, Anthony, Garnacho, Bruno and Rashford. We didn't start um, that team. We actually had Hoyland in the team instead of Rashford, but that was it. The rest of the team is there. Early chance for Bruno, but he just slots it wide, just instead of slotting it into the bottom corner. And I will say, lads, I'm really tempted to um, to sign a few players. But obviously, we're going to wait for you guys to pick in the live stream in the January transfer window, which will be after 19 matches. And we'll be doing a lot of graphics up. They had an early chance here as well. They had probably one or two chances in the first half. It was very sloppy. It was very physical. This is our best chance so far. Garnacho back to Bruno. Bruno will spread it out wide to Highland, who takes up a right wing position. That interchange in formation we're playing. Lovely little slip. And all I had to do was pop that over to Anthony. But to be honest with you, Anthony wouldn't pass to his mother, so we're not passing to him. Now, Bruno is our main guy, lads. Honestly, he is our main guy. He's our genuine attack and trek going forward. But I do like Garnacho, and that should have been a simple finish from me. That's just my mistake. And then they started to play a little bit. Sheffield United came out. The game, I think, is fun offline. The problems that this game runs into, I think, is more from a visual uh, point of view because the gameplay is quite fun there is a couple of issues with the gameplay obviously still you'll see in a second but this is a brilliant counter from us and Garnacho with the pace as we've been training him up lovely little 360 and a finish that Louis Binbin would be proud of now I must resist the urge to sign Louis Binbin lads let me know in the comments below if you would like me to sign Louis Binbin in the January transfer window because it would be a bit of banter but yeah I must try resist but that was a great goal and then in the 75th minute just when I should have you know shut up shop um, they actually, you know, get a goal from this mistake from me. It's a horrible pass back. This is kind of an issue with the offline is that the players pass the ball very flat. It's slightly different to offline. You'll see here, again, another mistake from me with Mainu. He's prone to these because he's got such low stats. So the stats seem to matter a little bit more offline because they're a bit more balanced. We had a couple of subs on here. Wambasaka, straight up, a little fake shot into Ahmad Diallo, who he brought on. Lovely true ball to Bruno. Bruno keeps her moving. Little touch from Highland, and then it's a cheeky little finish, and that is straight from the kickoff. 78 minutes on the clock, and Highland and the boys are going to go absolutely mental here because they're enjoying that goal. It's a lovely ball in from Bruno. Bruno has now been involved in every single one of our goals, either assisting or scoring, and we do end with a 2 1. Of course, I'm doing all these graphics myself, so let me know if you guys enjoy them. Did they add to it? The challenge is cleared, we get another 3,000 mile league points, and then we have a massive match coming up against Chelsea. So we're just going to do a quick roundup of this, and then we're going to go straight into Chelsea and see how we get on there. This is obviously, we're playing every match at Legend anyway, so it doesn't really make a difference at that this one is set at Legend. Um, we're not using any of the boosters or anything like that. So this is the top of the table after, what, three games? We've got three matches played, we've won two, we've drawn another... You can see that Newcastle City, Forest, West Ham, Liverpool are all in the same boat as us. Brentford have, have won two and lost one. The rest of the teams that you see there, Arsenal have won, drawn, and they obviously, we beat them as well. Um, or we will be playing them very, very, um, again in the second round. So that'll be fun. Um, but Newcastle United look to be pretty decent. They're scoring a lot of goals. We've only five goals scored, which is a bit of a concern. Um, so yeah. Like the re the second half of the table, the re second half, even though we're not going to get too far ahead of ourselves, you know, the likes of Arsenal, Liverpool, we'll have to play them again twice, you know, twice in total. So it is going to be difficult. But yeah, it's kind of the usual suspects at the top and we're glad that we haven't lost yet. So on to Chelsea. It's Chelsea coming in. Stick them a couple of headbutts, boys. We need to get physical today now with Chelsea, man. They've got a good squad, good players. Very difficult sometimes to defend out wide positions. Uh, but we'll see. We struggle against Arsenal, but we did get the win. So hopefully, we are the away side, so we'll go in our third jersey. Actually, one change today, boys. We're going with Casemiro, lads. He's going to come in as CMF, or else we might put him as a DMF with the anchorman. Mainu, we're still sticking with him. We've got Bruno through the middle, and we are back to Rashford in the central position here. Big game expected out of Garnacho. All right, let's go, man. We're straight in. We're going to walk, watch the players come out. We're going to go straight in. I don't even want to look at the team. We're just going straight in. This is going to be a big game. If we win this, I think we're going to be in a good position in the league in the first four or five games. So I'm going to try and keep it tight at the start and see how we go. Because Chelsea have come to play, in my opinion. Gusto at the right back position, of course, as well. 
Palmer is having a great season for Chelsea in real life. Gusto again. Well on, well in. Casemiro back today. Lovely ball. Rashford keep it spread. Bruno. Oh, Bruno. Like a hot knife through butter. Bruno. It's a great closeout. Oh, man. Gusto. Well read. Great ball. Good defending again. Garnacho hit him on the break. Anthony, keep running. Keep running. Keep running. You've got the pace. Cut in. Anthony blows past Sterling. Can he hit the ball? It's in the... <sighs> Silva just saw it the whole way. So a draw here away from home would be good if we can, but we just we just can't. It seem... Oh, that's beautiful. I was just saying we can't intercept anything even. Gusto Garnacho will have the pace. The recycle. Beautiful Garnacho. Dallo back post. Great ball. Bruno again. Oh man, Bruno's been doing it all this season. What a player Bruno has been. His big time card is brilliant. Bruno again. Back to Bruno. Rashford wasn't expecting it and they clear it. Now we're cooking, lads. Now we're cooking with gas, man. Let's go. We might win that. Garnacho put the shift in. Well, oh, Garnacho. Oh, Garnacho, you let me down big time. You let me down, Garnacho. This is dangerous, Garnacho. Well, on, Varane. Lovely. Anthony. Oh, man, it's been that sort of game. I've been under serious pressure. And your keeper, it's too late, 1-0. Oh man, that's all my mistake there from Anthony. Just got caught in possession. Ah, oh, it's a smart finish as well from Roja. Garnacho, and on running. The long Garnacho, that's better. Rashford, it's a terrible pass, lads, from Rashi. He's been poor in this mile league so far for us. Garnacho, man, the matchup just isn't, isn't slick enough today. Chelsea skipping past me, going for corners, going for crosses, going for dribbles. Dallo again, and it's two lads. What can I do, man? I'm just being absolutely destroyed. I'm actually getting a bit frustrated, man, honestly. I'm getting absolutely destroyed. I cannot touch him. Good, man. This is not good at all. I'm reading him. Lovely. Ericsson, this is what you're on for, Ericsson. Anthony, Martial, Garnacho, let it run. That's beautiful. We don't want the free. Bruno gets clipped. That's better play, lads. It's definitely the most difficult match we've played in my league. It's a great effort. Anthony, and they just clear it. No way does that go out. Of course it doesn't. Great ball to Harry Maguire, we have to bring on desperate times. Is Anthony on? Oh, that's not Anthony, that's Garnacho. Bruno! Bruno! No, it's that type of game, boys. We just can't score, man. We can't score. I think, look, we've settled. We've settled in this one in the second half, but that's kind of the best chance that we've had all day. And usually I pop those home. I didn't put a finesse on it, I just straight up shot. And it's not good enough in the 82nd minute. Chelsea you are going to be happy enough just to sit back now, soak up the pressure, pick their passes. We have to go all out attack. Or a little combination of it. But yeah, they've, they've just absolutely killed us possession wise. They've killed us with pretty much everything that they've done. The Kunku. That's brilliant play, ripping me to shreds now as the pressure's off. Bruno, fancy as ever. Ah oh, man, I'm just a second behind as well. My mind is a second behind today. It's a great ball and they seal the deal, they do man, it's attacking. And we're getting cooked, we've been turned over in possession three times. And this is more like the United as we are at the moment lads, Nakunka winning the header and Harry Maguire just does not want to know about it in the back of the net and it's 3-0, it's an embarrassing, embarrassing. Ah, oh, man that's a sick result, Chelsea 3. Manchester United, zero. That is a sickener, boys. That is an absolute sickener, man. It really, really is a sickener. And boys, we're straight in. Klopp's last hurrah.